call you and I see that you've got crisps in your cupboard or chocolate in your cupboard, I will ask you to simply throw them away. Some people don't have like the, the sheer will inside themselves so they need someone else to do it for them. And that is purely why I sometimes FaceTime clients and like show me your cupboards. When I create a meal plan or a training plan for people, I ask them to take photos, timestamp their workouts, timestamp their food, etc. Purely because as we all know, people tend to cheat. And they can say they're training, they can say they're eating the right food, they can create their food diaries, but unless they're actually proving it, you won't know. During my training sessions with you, outside of that, I'll also FaceTime you and be like, have you got five minutes spare? Let's do a little mini workout now. This just gives you that extra motivation to be moving, make sure you're doing your training. And it also shows that I actually care about what you're doing, how you're getting along. And it actually shows that I'm putting the effort in on my side as well. I can get you from A to C, but you have to do B yourself. If you're not willing to do the B, then we're not going to work. I will only ever take on a client that I know I can get results with. If I think that you're being lazy, I will tell you. If you're not willing to meet me halfway, then I will simply say, we're not going to carry on with this. It's a waste of my time. It's a waste of your money. And that's what it is. Like I train people to help them get results because I like helping people and that's the end of it.